Moving on to the spod rods. There's four in the range, and the same as the marker rods, they will all complement the tribal selection of rods. So whichever one you pick, your spod rod will complement your marker, which will also complement your, your three or four rods that you're choosing to fish with. There's three standard spod rods in the range, all around £100 each. The first one is a 12 foot 5, second is a 12 6, 5 and a half, and the last one is a 13 foot 5 and a half. There is one special intensity, which is a 12 6, 5 and a half, that's around £200, but you're paying for the 3k weave and the extra strength in the butt. Now, I think the main thing about spotting um, is I see a lot of people doing it very, very poorly. And that's because they're not compressing the rod behind the back. And in my opinion, they've bought a rod that's either too powerful for them or it's not powerful enough. I know that's a kind of contradiction. Um, my little tip would be to try and try some or have a, have a feel about what spots you use. So don't put a massive spawn on a sort of a five pound test gear of rod that's going to buckle it because you're never going to hit the spot time after time, you're just going to overload the rod. It's about compressing that rod. So don't go for the most powerful one you can buy thinking that that will make you hit 150 yards consistently because it won't. It's about finding the right tool that's going to suit your physique, your build, your height and your casting technique. Um, but we've put a lot more thought into these. Again, 50 mil butts to aid with the braid, 16 mil tip for the shot leader knots. Um, and we've tried to, to sort of cater for everybody's needs. That's why we've put four in the range. So pick one that suits you. My favourite is the intensity with the 3K weave. It's a lovely slim looking rod and it's, sort of, it's very, very consistent. So once you get into that rhythm, you can hit the spot time and time again. We've made all the spod rods a very progressive action. And by that, I mean there's power all the way through the rod. So don't think that you're going to lose any power. What that means though, is it's a more consistent casting action because the rod is doing more of the work for you. So you haven't got to get inconsistent casts where you're hitting 80 yards one time, then 120 the next, so you've got bait all over your swim. By having a progressive action, aids in a much more consistent casting style. But just to finish them off, 50 mil butt rings for the braid, 16 mil for the tip, because again, you should be using the shot leader if you're spotting.